A lot to get you. Thank you, Chris. In Southern Jefferson Parish, Grand Isle schools have canceled class starting tomorrow. There's also a mandatory evacuation for campers and RVs and a voluntary evacuation for the rest of that barrier island. Amelia Strahan has been talking with residents and officials there today as they prepare. She's joining us live with the latest. What are you hearing, Amelia? Well, the rain has stopped out here, but we know how common flooding in this area is, so locals are not wasting any time. I heard you mention that mandatory evacuation of campers, RVs, trailers. We passed dozens of trailers and campers already on their way to higher ground, and city officials are telling locals to plan ahead and play it safe. You know, you always try to prepare for the worst. Tropical Storm Francine has residents across Grand Isle preparing for the unexpected. It's kind of the game we play, you know. Uh, it's kind of thrown on us kind of quick. And after losing almost everything in Hurricane Ida, Charlie Lou is packing up and not taking any chances. We had to almost do a total rebuild for Ida. Across the street, Jason Sino is right behind him. We'll always evacuate, we'll always be safe. And safety is Grand Isle Police Chief Christopher Hernandez top priority. Make sure you have all your groceries, your water, your gas, for your generators, your, your flashlights, uh, things like that. On Monday, the city canceled school and announced voluntary evacuation for residents and a mandatory evacuation for trailers and campers. If you're going to hit the road, Hernandez says do it sooner rather than later. Thinking that you're going to leave it the last minute, think again. I mean, uh, the floodgates may be closed. And for anyone in need of shelter, the Grand Isle Multiplex Center is open to anyone in need. To make sure that they bring their own goods, uh, their own sleeping bags, pillows and blankets or whatever. Once weather picks up, Hernandez urges residents riding out the storm to stay indoors and off the roads. Plan ahead. Uh, we normally have time to prepare, and but this one looks like it got on us pretty quick. And I just want to reiterate what that police chief said. You know, nothing is more important than your family and your family's safety. So go ahead. If there's anything you need to get, medications, food, get that now before the weather picks up. Reporting live, Amelia Strahan, WWL, Louisiana.